it's Ash from Super Videos back for another video for season 8 of The Walking Dead. This is going to be a pretty quick video. I just wanted to share my thoughts about this big theory going around that Jadis is going to become Alpha from the comic book series. For those of you that don't know what I'm talking about, you're not a comic reader, I suggest you not watching this video because I will be spoiling some things from the comics and obviously these things will most likely happen in the show so I don't want to spoil it for you. But jumping back into this theory, to be honest, I think that there is some evidence for this theory. However, there's also some things that are there that kind of make me feel like it's going to be tough for them to explain that or to remix that or work around that. And also, just generally, I'm not a big fan of this theory. I don't like the theory. I think let Alpha be Alpha, let Jadis be Jadis. Don't try to make a character from the show be a comic character. Just don't do that. In my opinion, that's just lazy because you potentially ruin a comic character and also you don't have the courage to have a character that's only in the TV show without having to link it to the comics in a way. Or you don't have the creative confidence to do that. You know what I mean? So I'm not a big fan of this theory. However, I will point some of the evidence that's pointing towards this being true and also some of the things that don't necessarily work. So some of the things that do work. So both Alpha and Jadis are weird. They have their own kind of unique lifestyle. They are outsiders and they do live differently than, than everybody else. And you know, they are savage to an extent. We do see how savage Jadis can get and we know how savage Jadis is. So they have that connection as well. And also at the same time, if this happens to be true, then the scavengers could potentially be some sort of backstory of the whispers, which means that the whispers are not going to be the whispers anymore. They're still going to be the scavengers. So the whispers are going to be scrapped altogether and the scavengers will take their place. Now, some of the things that don't work. So these were the things that worked. So what are the things that don't work? One is that as savage as Jadis is, she's not as close as Alpha. We haven't seen that progression. And if they want to keep that progression hidden from us, what was the point of having like this backstory for the Whispers if the Scavengers are in fact Whispers? So if they're not going to show it to us, then why even have this backstory or this kind of story arc that's going to lead up to that? And if they're going to show it, then are they going to explore this through the new beginning or how are they going to make that work out? And also, they would probably have to explain exactly what leads Jadis to go away and come back. You know, she could potentially run into the Whispers and become a Whisper. That's a more likely situation. But in terms of Jadis becoming Alpha, she would have to first become the Alpha character in terms of the state of mind. Then she would have to merge into this group or create this group that's going to become the Whispers. And it's not just one or two of them. There's a lot of them. Not as many as the Saviors, but there's still a lot of them. And the Scavengers are all dead at this point. So that doesn't necessarily work. And also, who the hell is going to be Beta? Who's going to be Lydia? Those two characters are essential components of the Whispers, just as much as Alpha is. I would say Alpha is even less of a big component of the Whispers because she died pretty early on. But, you know, if they don't have the same kind of beta character or Lydia character, how are they going to make that work out? So that's basically my opinion. I think that there's some evidence regarding Jadis becoming Alpha, but at the same time, there's so many things that will need to be remixed and don't work out that make this theory not as concrete as it could be. And also, just overall, I'm not a big fan of the theory. That's it for this video. See you next time for another super video.